Hello guys, in this video we will see how to create or set up AWS EC2 instance for Red Hat Enterprise Linux. I have connected to my AWS account, click on services, then search for EC2. See, this is the service, click on it. EC2 is nothing but Elastic Compute Cloud. See, this is the EC2 dashboard. See, in resource section, here we have different sections resource launch instance scheduled events migrate server and other options in resources currently running is one and instances are two which means one is running other is terminated volumes dedicated hosts elastic ips load balances key pays, security groups and snapshots click on instances i have one instance running to create or to set up new EC2 instance, we have to click on this launch instances. Provide the name. Here I am giving RHL8. Then in applications and OS images, we have to select the operating system type that is Red Hat. But we have Amazon Linux, Ubuntu, Windows, Red Hat, Susu Linux, Mac OS and Debian. You want to see complete details of AMIs. AMI is nothing but Amazon machine image. So I am going to set up or create Red Hat EC2 instance. Click on it. Here select the image type. I am going with Red Hat Enterprise Linux 8. Then here we have to select the architecture 64 bit x86 or 64 bit ARM. Then instance type. Here types of instance types which contains contains different C, vCPUs and memory sizes. I am going with free tier. If you want 16 GB RAM and 4 CPUs you can select T3 X large. This is for this is just for video purpose. For production, you have to select the different one. Now, key pair. We have to use a key pair to securely connect to our instance. Click on create new key pair. RHL8. Then, key pair type is RSA and private key file format is PEM key. Click on create key pair. Network settings. By default, they are selected create security group and allow ssh from anywhere if you want to custom ip range you can select custom and provide the details i'm going with anywhere click on edit and here you have to select auto assign public ip i'm selecting enable type is ssh protocol tcp port range 22 source type anywhere anywhere means 0000 you want to add security group rule click on it otherwise click remove it next configure storage by default it has selected 10 gp i have changed it to 20 gp these are the different root volume types i am going with gp2 for free tier eligible customers can get up to 30 gb of ebs general purpose or magnetic storage you want to add new volume click here Advanced details, go through each one of them and configure. Here we can use script data or the activities that can be performed once Linux server starts. See in the right side, this is the summary. Here we have to provide number of instances to be created. By default it has selected one. We can give one or more. Virtual server type, that is instance type, firewall setting or firewall or security group, volume 20 gigabytes. Click on launch instance. Successfully initiated launch of instance. See the launch log also. Okay. Now click on instances. See. See name is RHL8. Instance ID is this one. And instance state is pending. It means it is not yet created but it is creating. Instance type is T2 micro. Status check. Not yet completed. Availability zone is US East 1B. This is the public DNS. 
This is public IP. We haven't provided elastic IP and remaining are the other options. See, now status has been changed. Click on refresh. Now it is checking the status checks. Click on the instance. See here instance summary. This is the instance ID. This is public IP. This is private IP. Instance state then platform Red Hat and platform details Red Hat Enterprise Linux. This is AMI ID, key pair name, number of CPUs. Okay, these are the details. We have to wait until this initializing change it to like 2 by 2 checks passed. Click on this refresh. Wait until it completes. Then we will see how to connect to this instance. I am pausing this video until this status check completes. See, checks passed. Now click on the instance. Now click on this connect. See, first try with EC2 instance connect. It should fail because except Ubuntu and Amazon Linux, we cannot connect with the free tier with the free tier architecture. So click on SSH client, copy this link, then open terminal or command prompt, then go to downloaded PEM file. See by default it has go to users and art schools, but you have to go to where this fem file fem key file is downloaded otherwise it will not allow or you have to copy this fem file to this path okay this file is located in downloads cd downloads now paste this string in the command prompt see we have successfully connected Amazon EC2 for Red Hat Linux. Let's verify. Control it to clear screen. More slash etc slash OS hyphen release. See, we have connected RHL Enterprise Linux and version is 8.6. So, in this video, we have seen how to create, launch, or set up AWS EC2 instance for. RHL or Red Hat Enterprise Linux step by step. For more AWS or Cloud or Linux videos, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.